This is Jeff from PlaySight, and today's tutorial is going to show you how to live stream your tennis footage through the PlaySight app. So on the new app, you want to click Live Broadcast on the bottom menu bar, and this is going to turn your phone into a broadcasting streaming device. And you can share the link on social media, via email, via text, and you can have your friends and family and fans, for that matter, tune in and watch any of your tennis sessions that you set up through your phone. This means that you don't necessarily need to have access to a smart court to take advantage of PlaySight's technology. So once you click on Live Broadcast, it's going to prompt you, if this is the first time you've done it, to sign in through your Google account. All of our streaming is done through Google and YouTube. And once you have that set up, you're going to select Broadcast, and then a channel will be opened up. And as it says here, it typically takes between 10 and 20 seconds for a channel to open up. And now you're live, and again, you have the option to share now, or you can share later once the video is started. And the stream is now live, as you can see on the right side. You can click the share icon if you want to pull up the options to share the stream again. Uh, you can flip the camera around as well. And you would typically be doing this on a tennis court. We're just showing a copy of Tennis Magazine as an example here. And what's different from our app compared to other live streaming platforms is that all of your live streaming content is automatically saved to your PlaySet account. So on your activities page, it'll load in a minute or two once you have the stream closed and you can access your smart court, live court, and any manually live stream sessions here.